Hey guys, welcome back to We Who Flow Surf and Shore. Today we are going to go through a little bit of a surf warm up. We're going to go through a kind of a dynamic flow type warm up where we're going to really incorporate a lot of lower body, a lot of upper body, trying to get arms, everything moving a little bit so that we can get out into the waves, stay out there for a while, and get everything warmed up before we go so that we can surf longer and hopefully have more days out in the waves, especially if there's a nice south swell coming through or winter times, you get that nice north swell. You can stay out there the entire time, making sure that you stay nice and healthy, get the body limbered up and ready to go. So through this, we're gonna go through kind of a series of movements where one is going to kind of go into another. The reason I really like this is it's very dynamic. It requires a lot of muscle, warm up and a lot of kind of dynamic control that you're really going to need for surfing as well as incorporating into it a mobility component to make sure that we're moving the way that we should whether we're paddling whether we're popping up whether we need to rotate through thoracic spine in order to get out into the waves so we're going to start off i'm going to kind of do this traveling you can do this stationary if you're not on the beach or if you're on the road or something like that you don't have a nice little runway to go with. You can do this one in place. I like moving with it. I feel like it just helps a little bit more with the flow, but you can try it out however you want to do it. So we're gonna start off nice and easy, just going down, little walk out. From here, going into a little push up. Arms are gonna come back out in front. Out in front, we're just gonna kind of press down, really trying to make sure we're reaching our fingers out up top. From here, gonna to kind of slide down, going back up into that push-up position. Go up into a little bit of a cobra, add a little bit of a twist. Get a little neck movement in there as well, making sure that we can rotate through there. From here, going into a lunge. We go up nice and tall, reaching up, going down, rotating a little bit, going the other side, rotating through. You can add arms in all the way if you want. I usually just go a little more of a chicken wing through the rotation. I find that that's enough to kind of open up pecs and get that rotation through thoracic spine. From here, going back up again, reaching up overhead. And then coming up, over into other side, rotate down, rotate back up, going up overhead, rotation. You can kind of tweak this as you go. If you find that you like a little different movement series or you want to add in a little bit more head movement, anything like that, it's okay to add in those little variations. These are just kind of my standard ones that I go through. Just going through, making sure I'm getting shoulders, trunk rotation, I'm getting a little bit of head movement, I'm getting hips warmed up, I'm getting legs warmed up through some of those lunges. From there, nice and easy, coming up, going back, coming back down from here. Little rotation, and then standing up. That's my nice little surf warm up that I really like. Helps out, very dynamic. A lot of legs, a lot of thoracic rotation. Those are gonna be the big things that I really think that you need that are gonna help out, keep you healthy while you are surfing. Try that out, see what you think. If you like it, there's more mobility videos over on our YouTube channel.